Without further ado, let us carry on. It's been a while with The Walking Dead. And hopefully we can continue our story. And we're going to import, save one. So AJ, Kenny and Clem continued on to Wellington, where Clem learned Kenny would not be allowed in. So they left Wellington together. Oh, snap. So, uh, yeah, as always, there is five episodes by the looks of it. So, Tires That Bind, part one, when, when, is that Xavier, Javier? Xavier and his family accidentally cross paths with a rival group. A simple misunderstanding quickly spirals out of control. So, uh, let's uh, buckle up, guys, and uh, let's get ready for some hard-hitting stories. We'll go with that. It's barely is it visible for you guys? I just up it a bit. I don't think it's uh make sure if you guys can see everything. I think that's about good. And without further ado, let us begin. Of course, the one night I'm not streaming in 1080p, I have quality options. Looks to be me. This game adapts to the choice you make. The story is tailored to how you play. One of the great things we love about this game. Turn it over a little bit for you guys. Hey. It's time. Get over here. All right. I'll, uh, I'll start packing up. I need some. Um, some tiles. Please. Thank you. What's the crowd play? That looks interesting. Oh, that's interesting indeed. I didn't realize there's, um, There's actually a way that you guys could uh, choose, but I don't know how that will work, so maybe we'll look into that for the next one. Now, Poppy, you need to hurry. Look, I'm not giving you shit, okay? I'm just... You weren't here when Dad was sick, okay? I get it, but... You need to fucking be here when he goes. Sorry, is the, uh... I might just make the subtitles a little bit bigger. They don't look particularly big. I just think if anybody that's, uh... Reading along... It's like David. Uh, it's David. Hey, getting drunk. Hey, David. I had to leave my car. It's traffic's just it's backed up for miles. He's dead. No. No, I, I, I tried. You're a piece of shit. You know that? One time. Just the one goddamn time that you needed to be here. I tried. Please, I tried. Oh, you tried. You fucking tried? Yikes. Everyone's here. They've been here for days. And where the fuck were you? <clears throat> we're there, all around him. People who love him all around him. Cheers, he's Mika. scared. I'm seeing the panic in his eyes and he's searching the room. Donde esta Javier? Donde esta mi hijo? I'm there, right beside him, holding his hand. Like a good son. And he doesn't even see me. He doesn't even see me because he's looking for you. You don't think there's a million places we'd rather be? You don't think we all had to make sacrifices? He was my dad too, all right? I mean, you're not, you're not the only one dealing with this. And what a fine son you turned out to be. Uncle Javi? Why, why are you fighting? I could hear you from inside. What's going on? We were just uh, talking, Gabriel. Let's take over right. for our brother. Your uncle and I are just having a little chat. 
Go inside, Miho. We'll be in in a minute. Go on. It's okay. Inside. Don't want the uh, the kids to find out the truth, of course. It's not their fault. <clears throat> I should call someone. Pick up the body. Yeah. I love you, little brother. You know that, right? With everything going on. Well, you got a pretty funny way of showing it. You think I was jealous of you? No, I, I don't think anything. We've got a bit well, of that um, was for a long time. Yeah, I think we've got a bit of like older brother. Syndrome going You've on lost here. more than I'll ever have. But maybe something good can come out of all this. Because we need you here. It's time nice to doctors. grow up. You can't run from this. Not anymore. I know. You're right. I won't even argue. I'll be around more, honestly. I haven't really looked at the sales yet, to be enough. honest. I don't really know if there's anything I that I really believe want. That. Might just have a look through my wish list in a, in, over the next few days. Just see if there's anything that I uh, want to pick up. Kate. I'm going to catch that. I'm so sorry, Javi. Is my microphone all right? Um, just let me check my levels just in case. Um, it's uh, being a bit quiet. Uh, I said uh, I haven't really looked at the sales yet, uh, Doctress, to be fair. Uh, but I might look over the next few days and see what... Uh, Oh, wow, my microphone's actually up. It's not down. Oh, it's, uh... Yeah, I'll have a look over my wish list and see if there's anything on my wish list that I really want um, to pick up and see what the sort of prices and the deals are on them. I think I had an email to say about 18 of my items on my wish list were on sale. So, uh, yeah, I'll have, I'll have a look over the next few days, see what's not payday today as well. So, uh, uh, jackpot! I'm so sorry. Thank you. I guess this is his brother's inside. wife. Your mom needs you. Yeah. What happened? Come on. So I get the impression like the older brother is like, he seemed to allude that he was a bit jealous of uh, his younger brother. And I think that happens a lot in families when, like, the, when, when there's a new baby in the family, the elder, like, sibling kind of does get a little bit jealous at times i know it kind of happened in um it happened in my household when we had our second child my son was um very jealous for, and probably still is a bit jealous actually of like because you're taking that attention away that's why i call it sort of like um, big brother syndrome or, or older kid syndrome just from my experience anyway Mama. Where Ooh, were yikes. you? I tried. I tried. I'm so sorry. Oh, it He's is a gone, masterpiece, Mijo. Doctor. So I would He's wholeheartedly gone. agree. He's in a better place, Mama. No puedo conectarme. Dicen que no hay servicio. Is this like... I'm getting like the impression like this is like maybe before the whole outbreak. Or just at you the thirsty, start baby? of the outbreak. You want some juice? Grandpa's cup was empty. You don't have to fill his cup up anymore, baby. Grandpa is sleeping. No, Yaya. People's awake. Uh oh. <laughs> That's not good. I 
Uh, I think they are. Yeah, I, I think Clem definitely will appear in this game. I don't know about Kenny. I hope Kenny does, though. Kenny is such a fantastic character. But Clem is sort of like the main character, so I'd be very surprised if she doesn't. Rafa? ¿Cómo es esto posible? He's a little bit more than that. Empire Ran Shaw. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh no, my face. It's okay. It's okay. You're gonna be okay. You'll be okay, Mom. Help him! Help him! Yeah. David! Yeah. Sorry, lost doctors. I'm sorry, Papa! To go. We need to get her to the hospital. Well, let me look at it. Let me look at it. Gabriel, where's your sister? <laughs> keys. Where the fuck are the keys? Take Dad's car. <laughs> keys are on the dash. That's safe. Keys are on the dash. <laughs> Mama, get the kids. Meet at the hospital. Don't take the highway. It's blocked. <gasps> Uh, I did, yeah. It looks interesting. I've seen it before, actually, Doctress. I'll bring the van around. Where's um, Mari? I don't know I what don't sort know. of uh, the yeah. price Mariana, from the stars. Mariana, we have to go. Yaya's hurt. Definitely looks interesting. Come on, honey. We have to go. No, no, no! 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 It's no! Okay. It's okay. County General Hospital. I know the way. I love the art style of this game as well. Yeah. Oh, he's been scratched. Scratched him. That ain't good. Yo, Brandon, what's going on? Welcome, welcome. Hope you're well. Very well, thank you. How about yourself? Good to hear. Alrighty then. So, this must be like, like I said, this must be like right at the start of the outbreak, so. They, don't, they, they seem, yeah, they seem to be like very um, unaware of like the zombies and everything of what's going on. Tell me so. when it reaches the campfire. I don't think I've seen this one. Well, playing this one? Uh, we've played it's the previous two great. like a couple of years yeah. ago and we kind of Not put it to the side and never really played it any uh, played them again. So um because we finished Damn up the game um, the bottle. week before last. Um, just got there. Because just we sort of like go back to this. Just under four um, hours. I don't think it's based on, on the actual show. There, there's some similarities in it, but it's um yeah. they are characters and stories that aren't part of the main sort of storyline, if I'm correct. I've only watched like a little bit of the, the the show myself, so I can't say yay or nay on that. It looks like the herd is speeding up a little. I thought it was drifting southwest, but I'm not sure anymore. Yeah, I mean, it is it is official within the universe. Um, I don't know I if it's written by the same people, honestly, I don't know. To pass. I can't um, shake the thought of but yeah, I, I do believe that they are separate stories. It just keeps coming. It's slow, but that almost makes it worse. We should keep moving. It worked for us so far. As long as we stay supplied, we're fine. Yeah, maybe you're right. The van isn't so bad. We'll figure it out. We always do. Hey, I'm gonna sneak I thought I was someone just in the road there with that like, little hula I can't deal. believe you found weed. Are you yeah, I guess it's like a spin-off. People were probably growing this before they realized they needed food.
Uh, sure, you let's want play me to roll. do that? The last joint you rolled looked like a kazoo. <laughs> You're driving, and I've come a long way since then. Uh, it was like three days ago. Relax. Mariana's got headphones on, and Gabe is drooling. I think we're in the clear. Obviously, um. Yo, Asper, what's going on, buddy? Hope you're well. Welcome along. You want some? Sure, why not? We'll have a little yeah. smoke. Okay, sure. <laughs> <laughs> we are setting an awesome example. <laughs> Don't judge me. Just oh, when I found out David had kids, the I zombies look, riding around. So I'm not a bit changing trippy. who I am around them. <laughs> <laughs> and when he proposed, I reminded him that I'm not exactly stepmother material. <laughs> Case in point, he was reassuring, but yeah, you know, I could tell he was worried about it. I knew he'd try to get me to change, <laughs> or at least he'd hope that being around the kids more would change me. You know. I suppose it did. Do you miss him? I think about that a lot. Honestly, I'm not sure. I used to talk shit about all those mothers who'd go on about raising their kids being the hardest thing in the world. Oof. Gabe's making me start to think they had a point. <laughs> His mood swings are just... Some days I just want to leave him by the side of the road. <laughs> I'm joking. I'm just like stand in front of the van here. <laughs> Jesus. Obviously. Gabe's been emotional. I'm good, thanks, Asper. Really. Thank you very much. I'm sure he's just, you know, going through a phase. Well, indeed. Emotional? <laughs> right. That's cute. Look, I love these kids. But I could do without Gabe reminding me I'm not his mother whenever he's pissed. Man, he's a teenager. Puberty. Hormones. Oh yeah. The second you start getting boners, the whole world starts to get dark. <sighs> what are you talking about? It sounds delightful compared to dealing with bloody underwear. All the conversation here, <laughs> yeah, jeez. Christ. I need to get laid. <laughs> I realized that was an awkward transition. Sorry about that. No, I can pull over. It wouldn't take a minute. <laughs> wouldn't be worth it for just a minute. Huh. Mm. Uh, what's that smell? That's gross. Uh, yeah, got my sleep. Hey. Mariana, shouldn't you be getting in trouble with Twitch? Sleeping? <laughs> or something? I already know you guys do drugs. That's a pretty severe way of phrasing it, Mariana. Don't tell Gabe. He's the one who told me. Oh, oh Death Wish oh with the 18 God. months tier. Even uh, one car now. Prime, all right. Prime subscription. Thank Everyone roll the much, windows buddy. down before you all get contact. Appreciate that. I hope you're well. We're about to make a supply stop. Just achievement ever. Click a few buttons. Achievement docket. Well, it's not like they're like young kids, though, is it? They are like teenage kids, so it's not that bad, I suppose, doctors. Yeah, I really enjoyed playing the first two games, DW, so um, uh, glad to be sort of like coming back to this one after a couple of years in between. <sighs> well, they did, yeah. Yeah. You praying for our safety, Mari? I'm praying I find a candy bar. <laughs> <laughs> All right. What do we actually need? 
Uh, a candy bar. Need, Mariana. Not want. Really need a candy bar. You heard the crowd. Please, God, let there be candy bars. Amen. Indeed. Everyone All has right. candy bars. Well, let's start with some gas and move up from there. Wow. Hey, where are you uh, going? I don't know to be fair, Doctor, because I got um I got all these most of these on a humble bundle okay, sale that's cool. years ago. Have so fun. I don't know if you can still buy them or not. Jesus. I thought somebody had taken over him. Telltale Games though. I hate when they fight. I like might that. be wrong. I really hate it. It's like all Gabe wants to do is argue. Doesn't matter what it's about. Hey. <laughs> I know that's what families do. They fight, they make up, and they fight all over again. At least you have your headphones. Yeah, but <laughs> the <laughs> yeah. batteries have been dead for a couple of weeks. It was really Morgan Freeman. I mostly wear them to fool you guys. Sorry, Gordon Freeman. Uh, it's easier to stay out of it that way. <laughs> well, when you put it that way, I wish I had a pair too. You can borrow mine if you want. I might just have to I've do I've got that. loads. I've got like the Minecraft nice ones. I've got the dinner. Jurassic Park ones. I've got the Bats ones. You the never know. Ones. These got loads. past four years, people have been hoarding all kinds of shit in all kinds of places. Oh, and Mari, if there's any trouble, you can find one of these cars. Yeah? Lock yourself in and don't come out. Not even once it's quiet. And wait as long as you can. Okay. Good girl. I think what Deathwish really meant, though, Doctress, was that you can still buy it. I think that's what he meant. Not necessarily that it is on sale. Uh, Alright, so we need some gas first, right? I don't believe I've already been playing for like 20 minutes since like the first time we actually get like free sort of movement to like walk around. Crazy. Hey, any luck, kiddo? I need a pen. You need a pen? Or a pencil. Just something to write with. A pen? Why are you looking for that? There's just something I really want, I really need to do, and I need a pen for it. Last night I was thinking about this stupid story my mom used to tell me all the time before bed. I used to hate it, but... <laughs> but then I realized I don't remember the ending. It was this goofy ending she thought was so funny and I thought was so dumb. I want to write down everything I can remember about everything, because if I forget, and they're all gone, I'm kind of gone too. At least a little bit. I just think that might be kind of important. Maybe. Oh, it's good That's a great idea, things. Mariana. Especially when the world's going to hell. Doesn't want to uh, forget things from the past and people from the past. Waste oil. No use to us. How many airboats do you have? Oh man, I wish I'd paid more attention to how many you had the other night. I might have been able to genuinely work it out. Most of the dashboard is torn out. Seats are gone. Ah, this thing's dead. 50... 54,790. How's that? Do I win? Uh, let's poke over here. Thanks for the hydrate, Asper. Oh, that's gross. Can we poke the mattress? Is somebody going to be under the mattress? Oh, only 16,000. Okay. Now I'm sorry I did that. You find anything? I can't stop thinking about that herd. We get caught in it, and, and that's it. Sixteen thousand eight hundred and ninety-four. Can't charm your way out of that one. And we'd be gone in seconds. 
Hey, don't think about that. We're stay careful. We're smart. We'll stay ahead of them. <sighs> Luck runs out just as easily as gas. There's gonna be a last one, you know? A last tank of gas. Last piece of food. What if this place is empty? And, and the next? And the next? We're not gonna let that happen. Okay? I'm saying that, but it's gonna happen at some point, isn't it? When everything's been looted. Okay. I let it have its five minutes. I'm good. Alright, Dr. Snowers. Yeah, we're uh we're on the Pepsi tonight, uh Esper. And now let's go and we'll go up there. Acetylene. Handy for welding, but not much else. Anything under the hood? Siphon the gas from here. I wouldn't have minded having one of these back in the day. I think I like the gas tanks right at the back, but the option to siphon is like right at the front. Barely anything. I'll need to find more. I don't think he's a real man, though. A real man would have, like, used his, uh, like, sucked it out with his mouth. Ugh, I don't think these tires would fit the van. What's going on in there, buddy? I'm in a bad mood, okay? I wanted to go away, but I know you think you said you got enough well, to redeem two FPF, so that's just over. Wish 50, we weren't always on the road. I like being with other people. It's just we're in that car so damn long. The AC hasn't worked in ages. And it it ain't my last damn tape. But we still got each other. It's better than nothing, right? I don't know. Maybe just leave me alone. Okay. But if you want to talk later, I'm Around. I guess not. I guess you don't want to talk. This one looks promising. You think? Bingo. Wasn't that the same amount you got from the other one, though? Just sort of making a point. We're going over here. Too risky to search up there. Doesn't look stable. Looks like there's more to see up here. More to see up there. Let's go. Any luck? Some. But not enough. Gabe? Hey, Gabe. Let's go take a look over there. Gabe? Stay close to Javi. Got it? Oh, all right. Stay close. Yeah. Can't imagine it's uh, very potent being in like a scrap van. Hey, look. No, is that one they never took anybody? to pieces? I stop by and saying hi. I appreciate it. Good for the catch. Rest of your evening. And thanks for the 50 bits. Appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Alright, so let's. Um, Let's check the gas first. Shit. It's locked. All right. Here goes nothing. <laughs> Fuck yeah. It's a good job we uh, found that zombie with a crowbar on his cheek, isn't it? 
Look at all that fuel. So the zombie shows up there, right? This is gonna take a while. Do we look at the ambulance doors? <gasps> Shit! <laughs> Metal crowbar versus plastic cap, right? Hmm. Looks like it came from in there. Gabe, stay close. I'm run. Wrong weapon. Wasn't there something just like crawling in the grass there? Hmm. Stay close, but then Gabe runs off to, uh... <laughs> Looks pretty there. run down. Might be able to get in through the hatch. And obviously that door's locked then. Locked. All right, so where's the, uh, where is the hatch? Must be under there, I guess. What's so interesting Ransacked about the car, a long Kate? time ago. Gaspionage. That's what it's like when you ask uh, how many points you got, Deathwish, seriously. <laughs> it's like a game of gaspionage. Random hatch. I mean, I, I don't know much about like house design in America. But Gabe, come check this out. Seems like a bit of a random thing just to have like a hatch in the middle of your floor. Not the cleanest place. Oh, no more those at least. Don't put the crowbar just down. Just be careful. It's a bad idea. What's worms? Wow, this place is decked out. <laughs> Jeez, don't get me started on worm, the worms thing again. <laughs> I still can't. I still have no idea where that stream came from. Ooh, batteries. Now I have two flashlight batteries. get the reference are you kidding me lucky for you they put enough preservatives in this stuff to last for centuries well, there's enough food in here to keep us going for a long time oh check it out this is actual honest to god pudding seriously and it's not just food how many there's a mattress there's blankets Someone else's mattress, someone else's blankets. We need to just take our gas and get on the road. This place does have a funny feeling about it. And if Muertos were to somehow surround yeah, us, 17,000. Now I'm officially creeped out. Come on, one 200, night. We bunk down, eat a real and meal. It would be nice not to sleep 10. in the van for a change. Please. The herd is coming, if it's not here already. We should go and get ahead of it, before it's too late. The fence is reinforced. We'll be fine. We found this. Why can't we just enjoy it? Javi, can we? Mm. We could stretch out, sleep well for once? Come on, you know it's not a big deal. Well. We've got guns. We can protect ourselves. And we'll feel so much better sure. after some real sleep. Go on, then. The kids are right. Don't blame me when all the we zombies We deserve a little break there. from the van. Yes! Kids, go wild. Just stay indoors and keep your ears open. <laughs> Just in case. Cool. You can have your own. He's pissed. Go give the camera batteries. Hmm. 
she wants to listen to her music. Ah, sod it. I'll save them for later. Watch the kids get all the good stuff, right? <laughs> I don't know how I always end up being the mean stepmom, and you get to be the cool uncle. We should be able to switch roles now and then. I'll Keep always the kids be the cool off balance. Uncle. No need to change what's already working. Cool Uncle Javi. Why? Because you used to hit balls with sticks for money? Real cool. No, I'm cool because I used to hit them really far. Also, people who are actually cool don't say cool as much. Grab some gas. We're out of here in a few hours. Hey, uh, so wait. You... You're the cool one, remember? She'd expect it from you. We get enough gas. <laughs> what the fuck do you think you're doing with our gas? Go on, speak up. It's my well, it's not now. like I saw your name on it. Don't fucking test me, boy. You ain't the loner type. I can tell. I know you got people. They're out scouting around, but they'll be back soon. They're not going to be too happy if they see you pointing a piece at me. <laughs> yeah, probably not. Then again, maybe they're already here, waiting to make an ambush. Fan out and look for the others. Lonnie, you're with me. Always the way, isn't it? Civilization goes to shit. Hey, you assholes in there. I got your boy. You don't want him getting shot. You best come out there careful with your hands up. Go on, you first. You get ambushed by your own people. That shit's gonna make my day. Yep. Something goes wrong and everybody goes Open crazy. Open it real slowly. No cooperation at all. Human race is screwed if anything like this happens. Like, seriously. Friends had a real face time. You can't just take what you like. I don't roll over like that. Yeah, I ate all, I ate all those. Yeah, me. You? By yourself? Yeah. Nah, why nah, not? What can I say? I fucking love pudding. Who doesn't? You got a real smart mouth. You fucking watch what you say. Look, I I, I get it, all right? You're starving. Who the fuck is it? <laughs> At the end of your rope, thought you hit pay dirt. Honest mistake. But I got this sneaky fucking feeling <clears throat> that you're full of shit. I ain't gonna let it be like the last time some assholes rolled on us. Keep an eye on this well, dickhead. On I'm gonna grab some cuffs. Make you him, got uh, it. Make him like roll over on Just them chill, okay? Banana peel. No need to make this any harder. Look, just, just let me go, okay? Please. Look, man. What's the this pain? doesn't have to go. The fuck was that noise? What you got hiding under there, boy? In an arm lock. <laughs> yeah, Clem will just come through the door in a minute. And like, if you know something, like you better spill it. Kimbo shotguns or something. You don't want me finding out for myself. Wow. Did I not just press left? <laughs> Jeez. Look, man. This doesn't have to go. The fuck was that noise? Let's try that again. What you got hiding under there, boy? If you know something, you better spill it. Guys, 
Get the fuck in here! Shoot him then. Shoot him. Holy shit! Jesus, you got a gun in your hand. They threatened you with a gun. Just pull the damn trigger. Seriously. All you gotta do. <gasps> Instead, we're in some. Hey, my family, where are now. they? What did you Heading do with my family? Nowhere. Just do us both a favor and pretend you're still asleep. I wouldn't start talking if I were you. You're lucky we do things a certain way. I'm already tempted to put a bullet in your brain yeah, for what you did whack, to Lonnie back man. there. If we start talking, I'm gonna get angry. What happened to him was an accident. Yeah, right. Keep talking, we might find ourselves in a similar accident. You get what I'm saying? No, Please, you have to believe me. We were just... No idea what you mean. Not another word, or God help me, I'll put you to sleep myself. We still got a haul ahead of us, and I'm not about to listen to you. What the hell? Stop! Stop! Oh, shit! Oh, no, no! Good job, asshole. <laughs> Try using the gun this time. Hey! There we go. <sighs> Fuck. Yeah. That's good. Just keep looking forward. Here's Clem. Look, I'm already having a bad fucking day here. This is not what it looks like. What it looks like is you shot an unarmed guy in the back. Or is that not what I saw? <laughs> Okay, now don't do anything stupid, because I'll shoot a lot quicker than you did. Badass. You're a kid. Whoa, wait, did you do that? With the tree? I was trying to stop the truck. Well, you certainly did that. Oh, shit. Yeah, you stopped it all right. <laughs> Tree fell slower than I thought it would. Put your hands up and close your eyes. Look, I'm the victim here. We're all victims. Oh, so it's okay for you to rob me? This is payment for saving you. Hey, that's for my niece. She loves chocolate more than anything. I promised it to her. Please. Keep your eyes closed and count to a hundred before you go. Wait, just... My family. I need to get back to them. We were attacked and I don't... Look, I just need to know where I am. We were driving down the 522 and that's when we found the junkyard. They're still there. I need to get back to them. I know where that is. You said you were driving? In our van, yeah. I'll take you to the junkyard, if you let me have your van. I get you there in one piece, then I drive away. Sure, we'll screw you over like Yeah, absolutely. You got a deal. Good. Let's go. She's like gone like proper badass. It's like... This really necessary? I don't know you. I don't trust you. 
And I'm not taking any chances. So it's safer for both of us if you're tied up. Come on. You must trust me at least a little. We're here, aren't we? I trust that if I don't get a van at the end of this, you'll regret it. The name's Javier, by the way. People call me Javi. Clementine. Clementine. Cool name. Like if you say so. How far exactly is it to the junkyard? You don't want to talk? Fine. But how about you give me that gun back so I can at least defend myself? For all I'd know, you'd turn around and use it on me. You give me a weapon, we can protect each other. I give you a weapon, I can't take my eyes off you. At least this way I know what I'm up against. But no trust for nobody. Muertos. The herd caught up with us. Muertos. What do you call them? Walkers. Well, what do you call the ones that run? They're all fucking walkers, okay? Look, I'm just... <laughs> I'm not used to being around other people. Not for a while, anyway. Usually, it's just me on my own. Yeah. Well, it shows. Meaning what? Meaning you could sure use a dust-up on those people skills. I can't actually remember how the second series like finished now. So, I mean, on the on the blurb when we started this, it said that um, Kenny wasn't allowed to go in a certain place, so her so she turned around and walked away. So I guess she's been separated, or something's happened to Kenny. I like I, said, I can't remember how the second one has been. It's been years since we played it. Um, I guess like they've been separated, and then she's just been sort of like left to roam free on her own and sort of survive on her own, which is kind of like why she's gone a bit. And like not trusting anybody kind of thing. It's junkyard. My brother's kids. And his wife. It's impressive. Surviving this long. Not sure how you did it. Just keeping everyone together like that. Well, I didn't do it alone. My uh well, uh Kate helped. She did most of the work actually. Sounds nice, having a partner. It is. How about you? You must have been pretty young when this shit started. How about Lee? I was, but some people looked out for me too. What happened to them? Same thing that happens to everyone. Shit. We can't stay here. There's a town up ahead. We can I don't know, stay because there. Because if, if I remember right. Back to the, if I remember back to the, like the first season, um, we all thought Kenny was dead after the first season, didn't we? And then he like just randomly showed up at that town or that village um, that we ended up going to uh, in the second series. So I don't know, maybe maybe we'll see him again. I really hope we do because like Kenny's like such a great character in this. Um, but we'll see, we'll see. Till the herd passes. Otherwise, we're Walker food. Can you do that? Please? Sure. Fine. Whatever you say. Thank you. Don't make me regret this. Come on! I'm trying to be all like, sneaky and stealthy and like talking really quiet, and then she goes, Come on! at the top of her voice. <laughs> there! Well. Get to the gate! Get to the chopper! Let's keep going! They'll open up! Oh. I 
a bun. <laughs> it's been a while since I've like played these like quick time event sort of things. There. I was like holding forward for like four hours and then forward. Attention, knock. Get to the gate. Get to the chopper. Just keep going. Go open up. Shit. Hey. Open up. Can't open the gate till you clear them out. Can't risk it. Shoot, Clem. We're going to go from a safe place because any of them. Yeah, but uh, she seems to allude to the fact that, like, uh, they're dead. Fuck! Sort of to, bullets but... will fire! <laughs> Get your ass okay. inside! Come on, now! And damn it, Francine, one of these days those doors are gonna close and your ass will be on the other side. <laughs> yeah, and when that day comes, Trip, I promise I'll eat you first. It's Clementine, right? You staying a while this time? No. Once the walkers pass, I'm taking this guy to a junkyard off the highway. My family might be trapped there, hiding from some very bad dudes. Well, shit. I'm truly sorry to hear that. This herd rolled in pretty quick. We're hoping it's gone just as fast. So, just keep your heads down and steer clear of trouble. You got me? There's too much going on outside the walls tonight. We'll be cool. Just need a place to ride out the herd, that's all. All right. I'm gonna hold you to that. And I wouldn't recommend changing your mind. If you want to hang on to all your teeth, that is. Yikes. Now head on in. I got shit to do. Well, welcome to Prescott. Welcome to Prescott. Why is Prescott the name it's Prescott? It's a pretty cool place, about? actually. Built from an old airstrip, I guess. The people, on the other hand, they're not my favorite. Usually I'm in and out as quick as I can manage. Not exactly an option this time, though. Hey, what's the problem? You have some sort of history here that I should know about? Not really. I just... I know what people are capable of. Hey, Javi. What's... what's up? My family... They're still out there. If you guys made it this long, I I'm sure you know... They'll know what to do. Hopefully. Let's go. This way. I gotta see a guy about some bullets. Well, that'd be pretty safe, though, if they just, like, hide out under the house, right? You'd think. Jeez. I haven't been in a place like this since... Well, you know. It's just like the old days. Listen, I gotta take care of something. Hang tight. Well, wait, wait. What should I do? I don't know. Why don't you make some friends? Make some lady friends. That's some cool. Looks like someone's in the middle of a game. Well, I'm not sure they are. I'm gonna let's have order. I wonder where they found this old thing. I haven't seen one of these in years. I'll talk to them. About... I've gone behind the bar. wonder if it's loaded. Play your hand. Keeper. 
You're gonna lose, but you don't have to do it in slow motion. Don't try and rush me. <laughs> I know your game. This is my game. Clearly. Always a smart ass. Well, it ain't gonna work. Excuse me. Oh, you again. <laughs> you got some moves. I'll give you that. Hold on a minute. Don't I note you from somewhere? I don't know. Maybe. Garcia. Javier Garcia. For what it's worth, I think you got screwed on the gambling thing. A lifetime ban. Shit. Should have had a 20 year career. Wait. A one woman triggered Kenny's anger by hiding the kids. Kenny killed the woman and Kenny. Every time the kid went to see the safe place, they did. Ironed it, but all three did not fit in there because low supplies to get in. And decided to stick with Kenny, and all three walked away. Yeah. Well, maybe we'll get some answers soon, Mika. Hope so. Yeah, I see it. Nothing wrong with betting on yourself to win. <laughs> and that got a lifetime ban? Uh. You want an autograph or something? <laughs> if I had a baseball, I'd take you up on it. But I'm fresh out. Anyway, I'm Conrad. This here's Francine. He runs the place? I just take his money. <laughs> yeah, well, maybe I'm just letting you win. Oh, actually, if you're the gambling type, game's poker. Five card stud. I'll raise you. What do you think? Should I call or should I fold? Hmm, don't get too intimidated. I lose more often than I care to admit. Though all it takes is one good hand. Too bad. He's bluffing. He's got bullshit written all over. <laughs> Is that a fact? All right, I think I'll listen to the man. Call. Moment of truth. Flip him. Oh my. Ain't that a pretty sight? Oh, hell yeah! Nice. Well, calm down, both of you. Thanks for the advice, hon. How's about a drink? On my tab. Bottoms up. Jim. Wow, man, this smells like turpentine. <laughs> That's the weak stuff. Don't turn away from me. I'm talking to you. Oh, shit. Hey, what's the point in talking when I already told you a deal is a deal and it's done? What's going on? This guy ripped me off. I traded him a crate of perfectly good batteries and he gave me a box of bullets that won't fire. He could have gotten both of us killed. Oh, yeah? And yeah, who the fuck are you, a bodyguard or something? Because I don't scare easy, all right? And I don't yeah, respond to threats, neither. She doesn't need a bodyguard. She could take care of herself. Believe me. Uh, well, you can't even prove those are the bullets I traded you. Oh, hey, Clem, come on. He knows the bullets don't work. Listen to him. He's not even nervous. I could have died because of his bullets. Oh, Unfucking believable. Look out! Come on, Pinky. Tap that key. I'm not too good on my button mashing. Hey, listen. Let's all cool down, huh? You were acting crazy. I was too. We just got a little out of hand. That's all. Just give me what I'm owed. Yeah, I know Jesus. you've been watching it recently, Mika. You gotta get her under control, man. You gotta do shit. This ain't no way to do business. Boy, you have it wrong, buddy. I don't control her, which looks like bad news for you. We had a deal. All right, hey, okay, all right, so, hey, we'll, we'll trade back. I'll find some batteries. I don't need batteries. What I need are bullets that won't get me killed. Oh. <gasps> oh, no. Oh, no. Uh-oh. Drop the gun! Right now! Say he attacked you and that he was going for his gun. I fucking warned you! Eli attacked him. I only shot because... Shut it! You done enough talking. Drop it. There's a herd out there and you're firing off a fucking... What the fuck happened here? He attacked Javi, okay? It was self-defense. Enough from you. Did she really have to shoot? Um... No. Do we stick up for Clem? I mean, you know. Yeah. 
Yes. Look at my eye, man. Of course she's telling the truth. The guy ripped her off, reached for his gun, and would have shot me if she hadn't stopped him. See? You happy now? <sighs> God damn it. I'm putting you two under lock and key until I figure out what to do with Whoa. you. Whoa! Okay, what? Are you for real? As real as it gets. Now move it. Got some nerve coming in here fucking up my bar. Well, proper effed up now. I oughta punch your fucking lights out. Both of you. But Eli was a grade A certified dipshit. I'll even have someone come take a look at that cut. Hey, thanks for having my back at the hangar. That was, um, that was cool of you. I wasn't sure there for a minute. Sure, we're of course. Anytime. Well, I mean, you and I are a team now. Thanks. I mean it. Come and join our family, Clem. We'll look Just after you. Don't think this makes us friends or anything. I saved your ass. Hello. Really, we're friends. I'm Eleanor. I'm what passes for a doctor around here. The trip sort of overdoes it sometimes. I hate that I'm treating you in a cage, like you're some feral animal. Javier, pleasure's all mine. Is it now? Now, let's see about that wound. It's probably a, a yeah, he got you like good. To, Mika. Try to hold still. <clears throat> Why is it always the pretty ones who end up causing the most trouble? As if good looks equal bad behavior or something. Yeah. Well, it takes one to know one. One what? One pretty troublemaker. <laughs> I'll give you that one. What? People are saying she killed a man in cold blood. If you don't mind me asking, what did happen exactly? That they were arguing, and that she went crazy over nothing? Look, things got out of hand. Clementine was only trying to make a point, but then... You make it sound so casual. Best thing is probably for you two to leave town. And get back to your group. We were attacked earlier this evening. There were four of us. Oh, shit. I'm sorry. If there's... If there's anything I can do to help... Well, not that I have much to offer you, but I know a thing or two about losing family. Do you really want to help me? Let us out of this cage. Eleanor? You done yet? Just about. All right, here's what we're going to do. I'm driving you that junkyard myself. Get you out of my hair, and no one can say I didn't do right by no one. In the meantime, you two can sleep right here and think about what shitheads you were earlier. On my terms and on my timeline. You got me? Uh, I want to leave now. Nah, no way. I need to get back on the road ASAP. Javier, I am not negotiating here. Trip, it doesn't seem right to wait. Javi's people, they can need a medic. Nah, no way. Not putting you in that kind of also, danger again. That's not your call. Look, maybe there's another way. We've got a rear gate down at the other end of the airfield. We don't use it much, but, well, we could leave tonight. We? Slip past the herd, get a jump start on reaching that junkyard. If your family does need help, I'll be right there to give it. It's too risky, and if Muertos were to somehow surround us, we... Don't worry. It'll be fine. Anyway, think about it. I've got to check on some patients, but I'll be back in an hour. You know, I never would have guessed she had it in her. Yeah. She's... She's something. The thing is, is something. and maybe this sounds weird, but I still trust Trip more than I trust her. Hmm. Well, even with her, we have to walk, right? So, maybe we should just take the lazy option and go in the morning. 
Clem has like a weird feeling about people, right? So you're right. Go in the morning. Trip's got more muscle, just in case. We'll wait and get a ride with him. Glad you're finally listening to reason. You know, when I met you, I thought you'd just be another asshole like everyone else. Nice, thanks, Clem. And to think that when we first met, you nearly blew my head off. <laughs> yeah, guess I made the right call. It's gonna be a while before that herd passes. We might as well get some sleep. Good idea. I'm exhausted. I'll get the lamp. And then the town gets overrun by zombies. Good. Getting into first gear is the hardest part. Hey. Now just stay on the road. <laughs> Most important rule there is. Now let's try oh, shifting into second. Not bad at all, especially for a first time. You just gotta ease up off the clutch a little smooth. Gotta keep your eyes right? on the road, Clem. You don't have to make the switch all at once. I want to do it again. You will. And next time, just be gentle. And once we get down to Florida, we'll in like ditch second, the wheels second gear, and I'll make pretty a fast, sailor I'll be honest. And she, Mark my words. the car be like revving, like revving like you too, buddy. Tell. I just can't get him to talk. It's unusual for his age. Well, the heater's broken. He's cold. Only makes sense to head for Florida sooner than later. Leave all this snow behind, right? Be like summer every day. Hell, I'm gonna have to find me some shorts. Are you sure Florida's better? I'd rather be scared and warm than scared and frozen. I'll teach AJ to fish, how to swim. We'll watch the sunrise every morning. All three of us. But we ain't getting nowhere doing 25 miles an hour. Shift her into third. Let's get her really cooking. Well, there you go, Clem. Time we get to Florida, you'll be a better driver than me. Proud of you, Clem. Hey, I really appreciate you teaching me. You know, I, I always dreamed about the day I'd teach Duck to drive. You're the best second chance I could ask for. Where's your blanket, goofball? I swear this kid never makes a peep. Who knows how long he's gone without a blanket. The duck was gabbing a mile a minute his age. Wasn't full sentences, but something. There's nothing wrong with AJ. He'll talk when he's ready. I know. Just a bit odd for a child his age. Then again, Albert Einstein didn't talk till he was four, and <laughs> look how he turned out. Crap! I got it. Turn the wheel. Don't. Uh, my hand wasn't on the keyboard. I wasn't prepared. Did it get like a blowout or something? Is that what happened? I guess. AJ? Oh, God. You're okay. Where's Kenny? No! Not dead. You're alive! Thank God! Is it AJ okay? Shit. Help me up. Be all right if you don't um, go back to the car. I don't, I don't feel anything. Th that's good. No, Clem, that's I don't good. feel anything. <laughs> that's a good Clem. I can't Jeez. feel my legs. I just 
can't get up. God damn it. Oh my god, no, this isn't happening. This isn't happening. Uh, let me try again. Shit, shit. Hey, hey, stay away from him. <laughs> You gotta go help AJ Clem. I ain't letting you watch those fuckers chew me up. Go, Clem. AJ will be safe with me. I'll take great care of him. I promise. I know you will, Clementine. I wouldn't trust AJ with anybody else. Now, go! Hey, dipshits! Come and get it! there <laughs> hey Clem yeah we're close I gotta say I hope your people are safe and sound Eleanor asked me before we left to make sure of it oh yeah yes sir so that's what I'm gonna do though why she went to bat for you I've got no idea I mean she hardly even knows you and you don't know her for that matter well, what's the matter you jealous? I just... I got a natural curiosity, that's all. Yeah, it's a bit of a... Bit of a tame-like ending for Guys, Penny, unfortunately. Guys, that's the place. Oh, shit. But what happened to AJ, though? That's what we what still don't know what happened to him yet. So, that'd be interesting to find out the rest of everything. Must have been hundreds of them. Kate's yeah. good in a crisis. She'd know how to get shelter. What's that? Nice pick. <laughs> Crush, you got a gun in your hand, mate. Just put a bullet in his head. Those bullets are uh, limited resource, though, aren't they? So. Mariana's tape player. Mariana? Mariana, are you here? Javi! Oh my god! You're safe! I can't believe it! You told me where to hide. I just listened to what you said. Lock yourself in and don't come out, not even once it's quiet. It kept running through my head like on a loop. I don't even know how long I was in there. You yeah, did exactly no, right. what you should have done. Let's just shout at the top of my voice and attract all the Thanks. walkers that there are. It was scary at first, <coughs> but once the muertos couldn't see me anymore, they just passed by. Kate and your brother, where are they? We got pulled apart when that huge bunch of muertos showed up. Kate yelled that they were going to try to make it back to the van. Then that's where we're headed. Let's go find your brother, sweetheart. Oh, no. That's trash, though. No. No sign of them. They must have seen it like this, then gone someplace else to hide. Kate. They're trapped in there. Mariana, stay back. That zombie. Javi, you found us. Hey, think, like the door hey, shut that. Like, okay. that, 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 like, force you might kill that zombie. You happy was, to see um, me? Weird. 
hate to disappoint you, but that really is a gun in my pocket. <laughs> <laughs> nice to see you too, asshole. <sighs> I, I wanted to come after you. I, I swear I did. You don't have to snot all over my shirt about it. I thought we were dead. Like, never gonna see you again dead. We only had a couple bullets left. Oh, I thought we were done for. There's no way I would let that happen. Yeah, well, you weren't here. The herd showed up and Mariana was gone and we were waiting and, and waiting and then... I was just so scared. I'm here now. You don't have to be scared. Hey, you hurt yourself. You must have scraped it in the truck. Didn't even notice. Hey, mm. at least it's not a bite. Well, not much we can do about it here. I've got a lady friend who's a doctor. As soon as we get back to Prescott, she'll patch you right up. I'm Trip, by the way. Pleasure to make your acquaintance. We should be getting back. Don't want to push her luck. Who's the kid with the gun? Does she have a name you want to share with us? Or are you gonna make me do my own introductions? She saved my life. Pulled this crazy stunt. Let me get the upper hand on the asshole who took me away from you guys. Her name's Clementine. Hi there. Glad I was able to help. Well, we're very grateful to you. Really. There's a town nearby. It's safe. I like the sound of that. Oh my god. Javi, do they have hot water? Even, like, lukewarm water would be okay. Ugh, oh, and bubble bath. Wouldn't bubble uh, bath be amazing? I think so. Right, Trip? <laughs> well, I guess you'll find out. I thought you'd been to this place. I have. I just... I didn't have much time to relax in my jacuzzi suite, <laughs> you know? Between you and me, these kinds of missions don't usually go so well. But you found every single one of your people. And you found them alive, healthy, reasonably cheerful. It's a hell of a thing. I don't jinx well, let's wait to celebrate until we're back behind the walls, okay? I don't want to jinx us. Well, some things are worth saying woo-hoo about, that's all. When we get back to Prescott, you still owe me a working ride. I haven't forgotten about our deal. You couldn't have known what happened to your van, but still, I need some way out of here. I was hoping you might stay. Yeah, stay with us. You know, considering... Considering what? You came all the way out here with me. Yeah, for the van, not for... Cool. Yeah, I think about Kenny, though, like, every, I, I genuinely thought, like, Kenny was dead after the first one. And then they like, sort of, like, rewrote him in uh, for part two. And I don't, know, I don't think he had as much of an impact in series two. I think... The thing about the like Kenny in series one because of his like what happened to his son, what happened to Duck, and what happened to his wife. So I think he was a lot more of an emotional character in series one than he was series two. Season two, he was just like more accepting of what had happened, and he was just kind of like trying to get on with his life a bit more peacefully. Whereas obviously Lee Lee in series one was always going to be like a more um, uh, his death was going to be, always going to be more impactful on the story because he was the one that had taken Clem and was looking after Clem and like almost like got Clem to safety, and then so obviously the things happened and he kind of like didn't make it out alive but sort of saved Clem. So um, yeah, it's, it's kind of like a, it's it's a bit weird really because like I say it's like completely two different parts of the story and two different characters who have impacted the story in their own way unique way but i would probably agree that like lee's was more impactful but i do think that like, i kind of warmed more to kenny than lee so i'm quite sad that kenny's died so early on like in season in in the season three here so it's quite a shame for me thanks <gasps> what the Wow. Really thought you could just walk back in here like nothing happened? <laughs> I don't think so. Javi, we can't leave her. Oh, 
shit! Dumbass. Uh, Seriously? Kate! <coughs> Stop! No. Stop! Harvey, help! Do something, Harvey! Do something! Run! No! This is return fire. Kate needs a doctor. Which means we gotta go. We got a window here, man. We gotta get a move on before they start shooting again. I can't leave her like this. I won't. You wanna die too? You think that's gonna help your little girl? Then get the fuck up and help me. It's time to go, man. We stay here and we finish this. Are you fucking nuts? We gotta get the fuck out of here right now! I already now. killed one of you. If we don't stop them, they're gonna come after your family again. Let Trip help them. You stay with me. What? No! Uh, Javi, you have to come with us! Javi, please! Trust me, Javi. We have to end this now. No, Javi! Please come with us! Please! Javi, come on! Get her back no, to Prescott. We'll cover fine. you. Javi! Go with them. I'll be fine. Give me a hand here, kid. Just keep firing until they're out of sight, okay? I'm ready. Javi, don't! Dun dun dun. And of course, dramatic ending leaves us on an absolute cliffhanger. Refresh to download the latest choices. What does that mean? If we continue. Did we not normally get like a summary of like what happened? Or was that? No, I'm thinking Life is Strange, then, aren't I? I'm sure that was uh, Life is Strange. Sort of like tell you like your choices in comparison to other people's. But uh more option. Is there anything else that we can see? Oh, we can just like restart. So yeah, that was uh that was a very interesting first episode indeed. Like lots like happened there. Um obviously um we lost Kenny. We don't know what's happened to AJ yet. And uh, we've almost like sacrificed ourselves to kind of like save our family. So yeah, it's uh, lots of interesting stuff going on right now. And i um, sure the story will continue to evolve as it goes on. But uh, I'm only going to play one episode of this tonight, I think. So uh, for now, for The Walking Dead at least, that's going to be it. Thank you very much everybody uh, on YouTube if you are watching. Hope you are enjoying a return to this series. And we'll be back real soon with episode number two. So make sure you stick around. And until next time, thank you very much. I've been, you've been awesome. Take care. Happy gaming.